1968 in the USA. In Iowa. Then I went to college. It's called Oberlin. Yes. In 1891, I taught elementary physics. Ooh. And then I got my master's and my PhD. <clears throat> sprays a fine mist of oil droplets into the chamber's upper portion. Under the influence of gravity and air resistance, some oil droplets fall through the teensy-weensy hole cut into the top metal plate. When the space between the metal plates is ionized by radiation, electrons from the air attach themselves to the falling oil droplets, causing them to pick up a negative charge. A light source illuminates the droplets to be viewed. The mass of a single charged droplet can be calculated by how fast it falls. The amount of voltage needed to suspend a droplet is used along with its mass to determine the overall electric charge of the droplet. No one helped Robert Milliken with this experiment. He worked alone. Through his experimenting, he also found a charge was exact integer multiples of plus and minus electrons. Just call me Milliken! Oh, he's Milliken! Just call me Milliken! Just call me Milliken! Just call me Milliken! Oh, Major historical events shape my life, such as World War I, the discovery of the electron, the quantum revolution, theories of relativity and the photoelectric effect, and the establishment that matter is made of atoms. Yeah. Autobiography. Retired in 
retired in 1945. Died in 1953 in the USA.